Alright, viewers, so all, my name is Andre, and welcome to uh, first impressions of a somewhat older game. Uh, this is Spirit of the North, and the reason I'm playing this game is because it actually showed up on my uh, Game Pass library. Uh, this game released in 2020, if I'm not mistaken. This is the enhanced version of the game, so I assume that it's enhanced in some uh, shape or form. And apparently, the second, uh, the sequel to this game, so Spirit of the North 2, is uh, expected to release uh, next year. Um, I have recently finished the base game of Hollow Knight. Uh, I will continue to play the game until I probably finish, you know, uh, the full story of the game. Uh, but until then, <clears throat> or not until then, but I'd like to uh, select the game to, you know, continue play. Um, I have played Cocoon uh, just uh, like an hour ago. Uh, so to you, it will be a video that was released yesterday. Um, and I decided to try this Spirit of the North and see how it, uh, how, how I feel about it. So, first thing, um, I actually had to turn on the emulation for my controller because it was not picking up the PS4 controller as is. So, it needs <coughs> emulation, which means that the game is not going to a good start, <laughs> but... Let's not uh, think about that, and let's see how this game goes. It, they, uh, the game actually has uh, very good reviews on Steam. That's one of the things that I uh, that um, basically uh, um, Shisa, I'm missing the word. It made me go into this game, so uh, it got to Game Pass very recently, yesterday I think, or today. Uh, and uh, Steam reviews are good. So I went, okay, let's at least try the game. Excuse me. What, am I a fox? I've played a game... I don't remember the name. Uh, I was a spirit something... And I had an eagle, if I'm not mistaken. Cred. Oh. Chapter 1. Can I run or something? Oh, no, I can walk. Okay. So. Nothing, just go. Fair enough. I assume that I gotta go uh, towards that red thing, right? <clears throat> Do I need to go through uh, okay. these rocks or something? So I'm, I have never played or seen any gameplay of this game. Therefore, I have no, no idea what this is. I don't know if there will be enemies, if it's just, you know, a puzzle game or something. <clears throat> I'm going to play for about half an hour and we'll see. Now we'll go. Hey, Talabail! Okay. Oh, I can jump by using two buttons. So this one walks. I like to see one that ran. Okay. Nothing. So I assume that I gotta go through there. Why are the mountains blue? Okay. It's weird. Uh, I've never seen mountains, ice mountains like this, but I, th through what I can see, you know, in videos, uh, ice mountains are white. And mainly because they are usually covered in snow. These are not covered in snow. These look like they are actually made of ice. And apparently blue ice. They're made of ice, with, with, but with snow on top, because it's snowing, right? So you would expect to have snow on the mountains. <sighs> but this is uh, different. Oh, you know what this reminded me of? Uh, Subnautica. 
completely different game, but uh You know what game I might actually try to pick up as well? Uh what's it called? Oh yeah. It's a sleeping skeleton. Oh it's uh the wind. It actually it looked like he was just, you know, moving, but it's, it's the clothes that are That's weird. Okay. Um there's a game called something Dave that I have seen B I don't know what B means. What's B? B okay. Why did it bark? Foxes don't bark, do they? Okay. How are you gonna go through there? Oh you are man. Apparently, bees this. Hola. Hello. And welcome. Okay, thank you. Thank you for bringing my cane. Oh, spirit. Oh. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4. So, 7 times 4, that's 28. Okay, I found one cane. Oh, is that my purpose? I wonder. To this is <laughs> this is the uh, the problem with the missing canes. The spirits lost their canes. They died. And now I need to give their canes, bring their canes back. Hey, eh? why was I give? Okay. I'm smashing the snare. Why is this... Why is the floor dark? That's weird. Chapter progress. Saving. I thought the camera got stuck on the thing. <laughs> That's a fox! B. Hola. I wonder if foxes actually bark. They... I have never... Okay. Oh. Yeah, I don't think I can do that. Eh... Certo. Okay. So apparently... It didn't do the same thing to me, but okay. Hot springs. Well, they are not hot, or are they? Well, we're in ice thing, so. Okay. Do I go where? Oh, it's there. Nice. Oh, how do I get there? I have no idea. B. Oh. He's like, okay, vamos. Okay. How the hell do I get there? Uh, okay. Um, let's see. Okay, jump. I lost the capacity to jump. Oh no. Okay, good. Well, I won't be able to press B here, right? Oh. Aha! Hey. Hey. Uh. Okay. There you go. I don't. Yeah, that's. Where are you? Why didn't you go there? Okay. 
Can I jump or something? Okay. I didn't die, which is pretty good, right? I just don't know where to go now. That's not pretty good. The... Are you going to do that every time you leave water? Where's the fox? Okay, we have a problem here now because I have no idea what that thing is. I think uh, uh, she ag uh, it actually hid itself. Oh. Now, there is a thing. Um, uh, the last game that I also checked was also a relaxing game. So I came through there, and I gotta go there, is that it? So, uh, playing two relaxing games in a row is weird. Because <laughs> I'm used to playing, you know, action games. Action, what I mean action is, for instance, I am playing, uh, I forgot. I'm playing Dredge, which is not exactly an action-packed game, but it is, you know, uh, you, things happen. And then I was playing also Hollow Knight, and things happen in Hollow Knight, so, hola. Oh, it's there, I gotta go. Uh, and now, all of a sudden, I just did two uh, little videos about two games that are very relaxing, so the one... The first one was Cocoon, as I've said. Ah, uh, Final Cor. Okay, good. He can run after, actually. Okay. Beautiful. So he barks and runs. Good. And I, apparently I can outrun the spirit to open. If I yell, woo! Okay. I lost my spirit dog. It's not a dog, it's a fox. Oh, that's not good. Uh, ah, does he? Okay. Are you trying to tell me something? Right. Ah, okay. It's very good. Okay. Let's go there. Now, I have no idea. Oh, I'm going to jump. Okay, this is fun. I... I don't know. I don't know if I'm missing something. Oh, do you know what toboggan is? I don't know if it's called toboggan in English, but uh, it's basically people in casket—not casket, but <laughs> people in uh, sledges or whatever that thing is. Hola. And um, chapter progress saving, and uh, they just. Go down on the on uh, hill, um, things like this, icy things, not icy things, but icy in ice things. <laughs> oh, such a bad joke. Okay. Oh, hola! Oh, this is gonna be fun. Hey, da. see that? A sledge, and we should be golden. And it's not a retriever. Because it's a fox. Although it barks like a dog, but it's a fox. Where's the, uh, where's our friend? He's, he's far behind us going, ah, Calm! Ah, putting his hand on his hips. Ah, no, no. Ah. You know when you run, or you, when you run just you know for longer, uh, for more time than you're used to, and then you get that uh, pain 
in, in, um, in the sides of your waist. Ever wonder if animals did that? An animal chasing an antelope going, ah, ah, whoo, bray, bray, ah. <laughs> Maybe they do, and I don't know. Maybe maybe that's why they stop sometimes. They get painful. Okay. Hola. Oh, yeah. Okay, I gotta find a cane for this guy. Oh, there he is. Pega no coiso. Theoretically, you should not be able to go through the door with that thing, but... Hamalele! And now we're gonna have like the second one scratched. Is that it? Two! Nice! But hey! I missed one! How is that? Well, it's super possible, but uh... Okay! Let's just go through here, so... Oh, yeah. Pumba! I actually... The first time that I saw, when when I saved, was saved. When I, yeah, when I saved the soul of that skeleton. I actually wondered, I wonder if you are able to save all of them. There you are. Okay. Anda, ton senhor. Tá? I wonder if uh, you're gonna save all of them in sequence, or can you miss some? And apparently you can miss some. Da 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 da. Beautiful. Okay. Oi, tá lá vai ele. Da 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 da. How come you? Oh. Me, tô graças. Hey, come on. He should have died. He hit the rocks. Okay. But this is not that type of game. It's not the type of game where your dog, uh, your uh, fox that barks like a dog, dies. Get down. Bless you. Santin. Yeah, so much coal. Oh. That's probably not good. Okay. The end. <laughs> Game over. Credo. Okay. Hello? Hmm. Okay, I can't... Okay, he's dead. Or not. He's... Oh, there you go. And, uh... Chapter 2. Okay. Guys, I am actually going to take this opportunity. Resume more options. What more options? Rewards. <gasps> Much better. Do I have do you have one that, that looks more like a dog? Okay. This looks like Lassie. Now, of course, uh, most of you don't know who Lassie is. Oh, he's humping. Well, see that? He broke his foot, his paw, when he fell on that rock. 
And there. Okay, it's gonna be a long journey. Okay. Great effect on the snow. Now, I'm not judging this game, by the way, okay? I know that it lo <laughs> looks like that, but I'm not judging the game. I don't even know... This, could, this game could have been made by... A very short team of people that makes this game a great feat, okay? Not feat as in one foot, two feet, but a feat as in amazing thing. <laughs> um, but this game is three years old. Oh god, that hey! that makes the game old. Okay, there's another fox there. Credo. I think this game is more about the journey. You know what I mean? It's a game that's to it's telling a story. This game is uh, from... Oh, I'm going to get this wrong. Iceland, I think. Not <laughs> Iceland as this, uh, but Iceland. The country Iceland. And it might have things to do with their culture. And that's just going... Away from me, I have no idea. Uh, maybe foxes are animals that have something to do with their story or something. I don't know. No, no, no. Okay, more skeletons. Maybe there's a story about uh, fallen people, Ola. Now, the last time I went near a red thing, I died. See that? The people are lamenting or whatever that thing is. The people are dying. Oh, that's not good. Is that, is that a disease or something? What's that? More bones. Okay, could this be like an accident? Okay, a lot of people here. Oh, there's a cane there! That's for me. Okay, so I'm gonna grab that cane. If I yell. Where's the other one? So I need to give this cane to a skeleton with a robe. Hola. What's that? People dying, getting sick, or getting uh, ill. Uh, well, that's it. Oh, it's a fox. Ah. Okay. Boom. Hey ya. Which one is this? A dog. How could I have missed two? Okay. I don't know. But apparently I did. Maybe you need to replay the game. To get all of them. I don't know. Is our, is our little fox gonna get better? The game's gonna take a long time if I need to just keep on going limping like that something tells me that uh, that bright light over there is gonna heal me I'm 
going to become the Super Fox. Olá. You know one thing, um, have you guys seen movie Moana? In Moana, the, this pile of rocks that you see represents a leader. So, every time there's a new leader on the tribe, the new leader, when, it takes, uh, when that leader takes um, the role of leader, he needs to grab a stone and put it on top, making a, a pile of rocks like that. Maybe that's a cultural thing some, somewhere. You know, a pile of rocks that just makes leadership. Know what I mean? Oh, the controller is rumbling. Oh! Did that rock just sh poof, magically appeared? I think it did. Okay. Okay. Why is he evaporating? The spirit one is just having bubbles. See that? Okay. Oh. He's giving his life-ish for this little fox. Hmm. You know, I'm kind of, you know, joking around, but uh, sometimes these games give you a, an extremely powerful message. Uh, there was a game that I played. Okay, so I... So he has no body. <laughs> He's just a ball. What am I supposed to do? Okay, but I... The, the controller was rumbling here. Why? I have no idea. I don't know where I have to go. Come on, game. Ah, uh, another. Oh, apparently yes. Uh, there was a game... Oh, I'm emitting light. There was a game that I played once. Uh, and I played like... Uh, my character was a little kid. And that little kid was... Um, was uh, on a world, in a strange world. And he was alone in that world. He had a canoe. He arrived at the game... I think he was a canoe. He arrived at the world in a canoe. He got out. And then he had to travel through the world. And he eventually uh, found a spirit guide, something like that. And as you go along the world, through progress through the game, you start encountering you know, evil spirits. And you need to you know, avoid them in order to progress into the game. At the end of the game... At the very end of the game, you realize that all this time the game, the the, the 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 child was dead, and he, the game was his path to enlightenment or something like that, you know, to go through uh, into the spirit world, and you see uh, what happened to him. He he drowned. That's why he arrived at the world in the canoe. He drowned. He was a fisherman. He was the son of a fisherman. He was probably fishing or something. And you see his father grieving him. Dude, I have two kids. That hit me like a brick. So, yeah. Sometimes games give you a very powerful message. We're good? A toad. Oh, I can open and close this. Why?
Oh, I broke this. I know. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Do you want this closed? Oh. See, I'm I am the orange fox, and then my spirit partner is the one in blue. Chapter guys, I'm going to leave him here. So I lost my spirit, apparently. Yeah, I lost my spirit. So, guys, I will not I will not play this game. I just wanted to check it out. Uh, as I've said, I think this game is worth not by the experience that you have, but by the story that it's, it's telling. Uh, and uh, I'm sure that along the way you would find that there was a, um, a message that this game is trying to bring you. Um, and as I've said a couple of minutes ago, some games, uh, 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 some games work in a way that you op you you kind of as you go along the game at the end or at a certain point, the message that the game is trying to give you just you know shocks you in a positive way sometimes, and I I feel that this is one of those games. So I'm not exactly in the mood to play this game at the moment. So. I just wanted to try it out, and uh, I hope that you have enjoyed. Uh, this is, uh, as I've said, I think it's a story game, a, mess a game with a message. Um, it's a relaxing game, not something that I'm not this. I'm not. I'm not exactly looking for something this relaxing. Uh, I played Cocoon very recently, and it's more of a, although it's a peaceful game, you have puzzles and stuff. So that's probably something that I'll go into. Uh, but I wanted to try this game. So, uh, yeah, guys, that's it. Thank you much for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed this little gameplay. And as always, I hope to see you all on my next video. Bye-bye.